Watcher everyone and welcome back to the Zoo Stars and Emulated Retro Game Channel and it is shit game time again and we have Yolanda on the Amiga 500. This is a paid request by YouTuber Ray C. Hello mate, how you doing? And I'm thank you very much for your requests and we're going to check out what your shit game is. Um, got a few goes at it. It's probably one of the most rage quit games I've ever played. Nebulous was another one, but at least that was a good game. But this is beyond fucking annoyingville of all time. Uh, I just cannot emphasize how much frustration this game can bring out of you. It came out in 1990, so yeah, we're getting late in the 8-bit life, so we're in the middle of the sort of 16-bit computer lives here. And it came out, but it was published by Millennium, and it was coded by Chris Sorrell, graphics by Levon Archer, Music by Phil Back and miscellaneous Steve Back. And Steve Back did quite a few games. He was involved in quite a few, such as Bad Company. He even did James Pond too. He got involved in that. So, you know, um, yep, yeah, Leatherneck as well. Fright Night, another good game. Well, I think it was a pretty good game. So he's got his name stamped across quite a few games there, but he's under a miscellaneous on this one. So I don't know what involvement he had on it, but it's terrible anyway. Can't find a good review of it anywhere. Most people are giving it, uh, you know, 2% out of 10 or whatever it is, 2 out of 10 or 20% out of 100%. It's crap. It's frustrating. It's annoying. She's bloody ugly as well by the looks of it on there. So let's just get on with it and see what the problems are with this game. Playing it on the original Amiga 500. So basically you've got to redo 12 thingy jigs that Hercules did. I cannot be bothered to read all the way through it. Can't be asked. But look, this is the problem. There you are. And you die so many times. Now, if you, now I'm on a different thing altogether now. I can't... See, now the, the platform's just turned to fire. It's just like that. I don't even know... How do you jump? Oh, for fuck's sake. That's it. This is what's so frustrating about it. It's classed as 50 action pack levels and the hardest and fastest platform game ever. I think, no, it's not the hardest and fastest. It's the fact that it's bullshit. And the trouble is, see, the trouble is you don't know what platforms are gonna turn fire. I didn't even have a chance to get started there. That's absolute fucking whack. All oh, right, so what do I do? I just fall down and I die. There's invisible platforms. You don't know where. That's, fuck's sake! You don't even know where they are. This is and this is nineteen pound ninety nine. Oh, for goodness sake! Imagine paying nineteen pound ninety oh, nine for this and getting this home. Where am I? All right, I'm up here. Oh, what a surprise, the platform's turning this game over again. What a surprise. Come on, let's have another go. Oh, right. What am I supposed to do there? Okay, right, the platform's on. So now what do I do? They're all on fire. Where do I go now? Can't... Oh, I've got a platform there. Can I get anywhere? Now I'm on fire again. So platforms appear. You don't know where they're going to bloody appear from. And you risk jumping in a fire. You don't know where to go. There we go. All right, yeah. So now what? Up there, no, no, okay, let's try again. Um, I didn't even know, I couldn't even see where I was then. This is absolutely shit, it's a pointless game. Um, I wouldn't even, look at this, what am I supposed to do here? Oh, fuck's sake. That's just ridiculous. Come on, it's ridiculous. Now what do I do? What do, where do I go from here? I don't even know. It's on fire again. The platforms are on fire again. Can't get anywhere in it. Didn't get a chance to even get to play it that time. It, I think this was designed deliberately just to, to piss you off. So the platform's going to turn fine. And so now where do I go? Right. So now where? Where do I go now? I can't. 
can't find a platform anywhere. No, straight into the fire. Waste of time. Pointless game. I, I can't make it to tell us this, Ray. Really. Oh, we got over there. Wow. How exciting. Oh, thanks very much. So you don't get enough time to get to the end of that platform. This is just stupid. I, I, I just can't suss out. And look at that. What? I can't suss out. And again, what? <laughs> Give me a chance. Where do I go now? Do I just fall? No, I collide. I, I'm not even going to read that. I'm not going to give it. I'm not going to dignify it with my time. Right, so now what? Up there? Yeah, and then up there, right. So I'm on the ropes. I'm just about to get on the ropes. We, we actually getting somewhere now, are we? Oh, now I've fallen to my death. That's about the furthest I've got on this game. And this is no different to when I had a few goes of it earlier on. I thought something might click, and it doesn't. Let's get up there. So what do I do? Go up. No, no. There we go. And now I'm dead because I can't get up that platform. Stupid. That's really stupid. And absolute waste of time. Just annoying. I, I, it's like it was deliberately done just to piss people off. And you're paying £19 for this. So where do I go now? I don't know where I go. I can't get anywhere on that screen. And it's put me back on this bloody screen. I don't know what to do here. There's nowhere to go. I just can't get away from it. Oh, great. Right, yeah, whatever. So you've got to be fast. You've got to know... <laughs> yeah, you've got to be fast. You've got to know where to go. But the trouble is I don't know where to go. I can't... Please leave your comments in this video and tell me what the hell I'm, I'm doing wrong here because I've checked the reviews, I can't find any good words about this game at all. Now where do I go? I have no idea what I do now. No idea what I do. Just jump in the fire, shall I? Yeah, just jump in the fire. Who's going to play this fucking crap? Right, yeah, as I thought. I know I've got to get on the rope, but I don't know where to go from there. Oh, Jesus, rat. This is no fun at all. No fun, no fun, no future. Rubbish. £19.9. Oh, imagine getting home and loading this up. Come on, let's try and... At least get somewhere. Can I get on the ropes? I get on the ropes. Get on the ropes. That's it. Wait. Get on the ro No, there we go. Straight into the pot fires of fucking hell. <laughs> I'm not going to give this much more time. This is garbage. There's no fun. On the rope. No, you stupid cow. Get on the fucking rope. Now this is where I don't know where to go. Because I can't, unless I have to land in between. See, I can't. I can't get anywhere. Done it again. Double jump. Didn't want to double jump. I don't know what to do with this bit. See, I don't know where to go. There's... <sighs> oh, I've had enough of this. One of the most pointless fucking games I've ever played. Because you can't get anywhere in it. And that's just bollocks. Music's not the best, I must admit. It could have been a lot worse, I suppose. But um, I certainly don't like it. Hey, I made a flipping... And I'm going to... Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Fuck off. 
Oh, I actually, I actually got onto a platform and I'm going to die. Now where do I go? See, I don't know where to go. I don't know where to go. This is pointless. Yeah, I land on the platform, but I don't know where to go from there. Oh, oh, come on. Oh, oh, now what? Oh, but what do I do now? Oh, I nearly... Can I do a level? No, I can't get that jump. Oh, fuck's sake, I thought I had that level done. That's the closest I got to doing a level. Oh, why am I falling down? Oh, that was so close to doing one level there. This is my last go. I'm sick of this fucking game. Oh. Yeah, well, okay. No, I want to go there, and I wanted to go there. Well, I want to go there, up there. Jump, jump. No. Nope. Come on, jump up, jump. Oh, for fuck's sake! This is my last go. This is my last go. This is bollocks. This is straight into the fire. <sighs> Now what? Oh, oh. No, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, yes, I did. Uh. But now where do I go? So I, I don't know. Where, where's that other room that I nearly passed the level on? Oh, and I've even done this one before. Give me that room I nearly passed the level on just now. It wasn't this one. Oh. oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Yeah, thanks very much for... <sighs> right. Now what do I do? Oh, I was supposed to climb up there, I could have done that. Enough time. Oh, it doesn't give you enough time. Get my way. Am I supposed to do it with you, bloody keep friggin'? Yeah, thanks very much. <laughs> oh, this. Like I nearly did it then. But I don't know where to... That's it. I've had enough of this fucking crap. There. That screen looks better. Thank you very much. I, I, that is a serious rage quit game. There's no fun in that at all. I know there's one out of six million of you that can probably play this. Or have been sad enough to try and beat this game. But um, it's it literally is blood pressure up heart attack material what you're getting for 19 pound 99 um 1990 this came out and um i i, I just can't describe it it's fucking crap if you want to play a a, a vixenite game 
then you want to play Vixen on the Amiga. At least that was playable and had good music. This music's okay, but I mean, it's it's just the game is fucking whack. You can't get anywhere in it. It's complete anger. You can feel your anger build up as you're playing it because of the frustration. It's it's too fast. You don't know what platforms are going to go on fire. And if I spent 20 quid back in 1990 and brought this home, I'd have myself castrated for doing such a stupid fucking thing. Um, I don't know what other formats it came out on. I think it did come out on the Atari ST, but, um, oh, my word. I'm glad I didn't see this back in the day. It, to say it's unplayable, I'd say it's more un, 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 unenjoyable, I should say. Um, it's responsive to controls, but you, you just can't figure out where to land. You lose, you die too quickly. There's no fun in that. That's fucking crap. Even for bloody three pound ninety nine in a bargain bin, um, absolutely shit. Use the disc and use it for something else. Wipe it and put another pirate game on it or something. But that's fucking shit, Ray. So yeah, I'm not surprised you suggested that. Um, I mean, these shit game times they can vary. They either have me in complete anger frustration or in some in immense laughter um the one the ones that had me angry was bad cat and crazy cars too the one that had me, meant had me in immense laughter was human killing machine on the amiga and uh, outrun on the dos on my shit game times if you want to check them out this is just just a fucking waste of space and it's going to get a whopping great 90 seven shits on the shitometer for that there's no fun in it i don't care who you are if if one of you come forward and say it's oh, i really like it you should spend some time then you're one in a thousand maybe one in ten thousand it's crud the game is crud for 1990 standards it is a rage quit hate game that's all there is to it that's all it's for and you spent 19 pound 99 for that uh Please leave leave your comments in you know below and let me know. Please come forward and be honest. Did you buy this game back in the day? Do you enjoy? Is there anything else you can tell me about this shite? Um, terrible, awful. Don't want to see it again. Fucking crap. Um, straight into the vault of shitness forever. Ninety-seven shits. Yolanda on the Amiga five hundred, and uh, that probably covers the Atari ST version as well. Garbage. Stay away from it if you've got high blood pressure. Oh dear, but at least the Amiga workbench screen is nice and chilled and calm. Brings a warm smile to Amiga owners. That lovely workbench screen there. Just you can feel the temper levels suddenly come down and it's just very, very good. Very good. Right, that's it for me. Oh blimey, I'm gonna need to chill out after this, I tell you, I'm gonna have to record a let's play, one of the games I like. No, this is terrible. If you would like to suggest a game you hate and you would like to see placed in the vault of shitness, then please follow the instructions. The pop-up video of place your request for shit game time will come up pretty soon. Go to that video and listen very carefully to what you need to do. It will tell you what formats there are that I can actually do them on, so be sure to listen to that first of all. All right, until next time, thank you once again for joining me on this edition of Shit Game Time. Oh, fucking one of the most anger, hate, reset games I've ever played. No joy at all. Stay the fuck away from it. Until next time, from the Vault of Shitness, Zeus, out. <laughs>